going to show you guys on how to do this amazing and really cute um, light bulb terrarium. So basically I'm going to show you two different ways and one is like a really a fake terrarium which is this one and one is a real terrarium which I believe now I'm looking at it and it just looks very odd. It just needs some moss and stuff. So um, and it just kind of looks plain now but um, you know you can always add anything you want in the terrarium so um yeah i think they're really really cute because they're just light bulb terrariums i mean who has a light bulb terrarium and i've been like actually wanting a light bulb terrarium because i've been seeing them on etsy and they can cost pretty much a lot of money but i'm going to show you guys on how you can get this for under however much you want actually because it depends on the type of plants you want to put in there and um, it also depends on like whether you want a real one or a fake one and I was very lucky to have these um, for a fake one for a fake terrarium I was very lucky to have the products with me already but yeah so this is really really gorgeous terrarium a fake one though and then this is just Real. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions or comments or concerns, leave it down below in the comment bar. Okay, so you're going to need some safety glasses and um, a pair of gloves which I will actually take off one of them because the other one I couldn't really work well with it. Okay, so then you're going to get your pliers and basically you're going to want to take off the top part of the light bulb which is kind of like this metal part. Okay, so basically after you're done taking that thing off, um, you're going to want to take this like black thing that's still on there and you're going to want to squeeze around there and kind of like pressure it so then it could be chipping off and basically I use partly the screwdriver and to hit onto it and the pliers too. Okay, so basically once you accomplish taking that black thing off, you're basically going to get a screwdriver and just be careful to just like jam it inside, jam the glass thing that's inside there. And after you're done with that, grab a pliers and like try to get more stuff out of there. This feels right, feels so bright, bright. So you're going to want to grab the pliers just to get more stuff out that's still there around the light bulb. And these are just some parts that you should have taken off from the top of the light bulb. So now starting for your rear terrarium, you're going to want any plant, I'm just using a mini jade, some soil and you know just your hollow light bulb. So because the mini jade had lots of um, leaves, like little things sticking out, then I had to like peel off some of them just so then it, the whole thing could fit in there. And you can put as much plants as you want, um, preferably succulents, and just fill it up with soil. And um, right here I just used a spoon in the plastic bag just to fill it up. Again, you can put as much plants as you would like, but since I'm going to do a bigger terrarium, I just wanted to use a little bit. So now starting with the fake terrarium, you basically just want to have a whole bunch of um, fake moss and um, sand. These are just some leftovers that I had from Michael's. And of course, you also want to have fake plants or flowers. Before you put anything in, just make sure that you measure out or see just like approximate how you want to have your plant laid out. 
and start putting in the fake moss or the fake soil. I forgot to record this part, but basically I just put in the fake moss and I am adjusting it with the back of a spoon. Now again, before you place it in, just measure out how you want your plant to be. Since it's summer, I just um, chose the best fake plant that went along with the season. And then again, just adjust the plant with the back of the spoon or anything you have. What I love about this DIY is that you're using that burnt out light bulb and being eco-friendly by planting, well if you're doing a real terrarium, by planting in plants in there. And besides that, it looks really, a light bulb terrarium looks really cute in your office or on your desk or even in your bedroom. So that's it guys and just have fun playing around with it and you can like, style it very different including you can have a stand on there or whatever you want.